Today we're looking at kettlebells and some of the fun things that you can do to help out your golf game. It may not have to be golf specific, um, but it's definitely going to help out with the core. So hopefully you've already done a little bit of a warm up. I have a 15 pound kettlebell, so nothing too crazy. And what we're going to do is we're going to start with some slalom jumps. We're going to brace and hold this to the front and we're going to jump and as we jump we're twisting those hips so we're over to here and you're just going side to side and you can tell i want this upper body nice and still and as i land you can see my stripes on my shirt or on my pants and we're just going forward and back okay build up to that set number you want but it's also going to help out with the cardio one of the things a lot of the golfers sort of miss out on Whenever we're finished with there, we're gonna look at separation with the upper body. So now we're holding this out in front and we're just gonna turn. Now, as we're doing this, we don't wanna just turn with the arms. I want you to sort of assume that golf posture, brace with that stomach, and really make sure that it's doing all the work. So if I had buttons on my shirt, as I turn, it's going where those buttons are, okay? The faster you go and the more you brace with that core, the better workout we're gonna get, both with those abs, feeling those oblique, obliques go to the side, as well as in that back. So we've gone through, worked that lower body, worked this upper. Now we wanna work and just do a traditional kettlebell swing, which is gonna be great for all the golfers for this low back. Make sure that it's staying nice and straight we're going out loading into the glutes coming up fire and squeeze those glutes we'll just go through and go to there the last one we're going to do is going to be a one arm kettlebell snatch this is going to help out with that power so bending over have this roughly halfway down coming up and going up over the head so again we're squat down have our knees in place, butt sticking out, really important. Pay attention to this low back. We're then going to almost do a jump, stand up. As that's happening, the weight should be coming up. And we want to produce enough power and force that as it's up high, it should feel weightless. So I'm not having to do anything with that shoulder as I'm getting up there. We can go through, same thing on the other side. So big thing, start light. Get creative with the workouts. Do anything and everything you can to work as many different planes of motion as you can. Work on stabilizing that midsection. Get that lower body moving, upper body moving. Really help out, build up some strength and power for that golf game. Help you start playing better.